Good evening. My name is Jim Sheehan. My work for 38 years was reviewing and evaluating budgets and many other kinds of financial reports. My subject tonight is Hammond City Budgets and other financial facts about Hammond. The 2005 budget proposed by the mayor was six and a half million higher than the 04 budget. The 06 budget proposed by the mayor was eight million dollars higher than the 05 budget. The 07 budget proposed by the mayor was higher than the 06 budget by seven million dollars. The 08 budget proposed by the mayor is eight and a half million dollars higher and has increases for 22 city departments. The mayor also proposed to transfer $5 million for three city department budgets to the Hammond Sanitary District. Hammond citizens will pay the $5 million to the Sanitary District instead of to the city. The mayor's proposed budget increases total $30 million. The mayor's financial plans and budget proposals would raise the Hammond real estate taxes $30 million at the same time that many are losing homes to foreclosures and tax sales. Did you notice that during the past four budgets, the mayor did not make one proposal to decrease the budget and decrease real estate taxes? Here's another of the mayor's big spending projects. You may remember the Mayor McDermott memo of February 05. The heading was River Park Apartments. Mayor Inks deal to buy property. The real story is McDermott Jr. became mayor on January 1st of 04. On February 3rd of 04, the city of Hammond filed a condemnation to take the River Park Apartments property from the owners and under the Indiana Eminent Domain Act. The property owners filed a lawsuit against Hammond as an action for inverse condemnation and damages. On December 2804, the Lake Superior Court entered a judgment against Hammond for damages of $3,402,500. On January 2805, the Lake Superior Court entered a judgment against Hammond in the amount of $14,247,500. The total of these two judgments against Hammond is $17,650,000. Hammond issued two $10 million judgment funding bonds to pay the two judgments. Hammond later refinan refinanced the two $10 million bonds. The refinance was by issuing two bonds totaling $22 million. The mayor then arranged to pay the refinance bonds annual payments of $2,600,000 by using gaming funds. The fifth and sixth districts each pay $650,000 and the mayor's gaming fund pays $1,300,000. Hammond had to borrow $2 million from the town of Highland to pay for the demolition of the River Park apartment buildings. The total cost to we Hammond taxpayers for the mayor's River Park apartment project is $35 million. Yes, $35 million. In June of 06, the Lake County Assessor valued the vacant River Park 24 acres at $1,212,000. There are only few of the many, these are only a few of the many McDermott administration's wasteful spending of Hammond taxpayers' money. The mayor's actions speak louder than his words. Mayor McDermott, by his actions, has given good evidence that he has no regard for the Hammond taxpayers and citizens. On election day, November 6th, you can stop the wasteful spending and change the city administration. Vote for George Janik for mayor. Vote for Kim Poland, 4th District. Vote for Bob Markovich, councilman at large. Thank you.